living space. So this room is what totally sold us on this flat space. In an ideal world, we would opt to have two of these cord sofas, big windows that are absolutely stunning. Today is Friday. We have a couple of errands to run. I decided to paint the, the living room. Um, initially I wanted to paint it black but I've changed my mind. I think I'm gonna go for like a very dark, maybe a very dark brown or a very dark green. But I want like something warm but super dark. And then I also think we are going to panel this area. Let me show you guys the space so this is our living room i think it used to be a door and then they closed it so this is basically drywall uh so we want to put i'll show you guys a picture of what i want to do we want to panel this area like with the nice victorian paneling so we'll panel this area and then have um like some art piece here in the middle uh, i'll show you guys a picture of what i want to do i think it's going to look nice uh so i want to do that and then we'll just paint this entire area and then maybe also uh, panel that side we are going to go back to antique bathrooms so i want to take it to um, antique bathrooms and see if they can polish it for us uh, we want to change it to this polished brass so we'll take all of these to them change this to polished brass and then just clean these and get it polished So this is what we call antique brass, right? Mm -hmm. So uh, I'm not sure the base material, but if it's plated to antique brass, that means it's a brass, the, uh, the material is brass. Mm -hmm. It's just stripped and polished and then it will be like that. Okay. Mm -hmm. It's just stripped and polished, sure. Okay. okay. Take it to Cape Town and then the strip and polish and bring it back to our factory. Oh, okay. So uh, we're looking at four to five weeks. And then roughly how much are we looking at? Um, we'll have to get a quote from um, the class from them to have to do this strip and polish. So, so if you say they polish, they don't just polish, they have to strip either way? Yeah. Okay. Guys, we are back home. I just saw, I just saw my hydrangeas, guys. I'm so annoyed. <laughs> I'm really annoyed. You know what? I think I'm just gonna let them be. Okay, let me show you. So, on camera, it doesn't look as pink as it is in person. But guys, it's not white anymore. This is pink. Um, and even this one. This one is now pink. It's only that one that hasn't changed. But anyway, I just wanted to show you guys my hydrangeas. Today is Saturday. We are going to get uh, paint at Leroy Melon. We also need to go to antique stores. I'm looking for the, I'm looking for the outdoor outdoor like furniture and then the ones i want 
like they are very expensive like i've checked on facebook marketplace they are quite expensive because i want the um, i want the um, the iron the cast iron ones i don't want like i don't want something new because i've seen that other people do like um make them but i want like old ones that have been used so i'm gonna go to um antique stores and see if they have anything i like and then we'll go to larry melon because we need to get paint uh for this room Let me quickly show you guys which one we chose. We had two options. We had this one called Evening Shadow. And then we had this one called Smoky Chimney. So we decided to go with Smoky Chimney because this one... Evening Shadow is also really nice. I really love it. But I think we can use it maybe in a different room. Uh, so this is the one we decided to go for. This one is called chimney green. I mean, no, smoky <laughs> chimney. It's called smoky chimney. So it has a tint. Why is it not focusing? It has a tint of green, which is what I wanted. So this is the one we got. This is how it's gonna look like. And this is the brand. 